Jason. Do you have a loved one in your life who received Christ as Lord, believing in his heart that God raised him from the dead, but who has now walked away from his faith? Because I know a lot of people like this. I know a lot of people like this. Be assured that God has not given up on him. Even if he has given up on God. It happened to Franklin Graham, right? He's a kid and he's all on fire for the Lord and he gets to whatever age our hormones start affecting our brain cells and he walks away from the Lord and he's this terrible guy, okay? He could have just kept walking away, but fortunately he had the parents that were an influence in, a, in his life that made him say, well, you know, I've been wrong and he came back into the fold, right? But some people don't have that. They, they, those things start firing off in their brains and they don't have any anchor to bring them back into a right relationship with the Lord. Off they go. They have forgotten. They have forgotten that they were saved. And they're, you know, whoever saw them converted is over there worrying, oh, you know, I, I, maybe he was never saved. And that could be true. We don't know if the person was actually really saved or not, but the chances are they just became like uh, 2 Peter 1, 9. They walked away and they just are doing their own thing again. So uh, I, I am one to hold to the hope that people that have made a commitment to Christ really made a commitment to Christ, okay? I can't, I'm not the one that judges that, but I hold to that in people because uh, Jesus remembers every person that ever believed in him, every person without fail. Um.